Hello. Say hello, Esme. Mm. Hi, um, welcome to postnatal week six. Woohoo! Which means that um, Esme is six weeks and one day old. Yippee! Um, again, I have to apologise for the mess behind me. Um, basically, we are moving house soon and so we just shoved all the junk up here to sort out pretty much so yeah that's fun so yeah um she's been whining a lot today I'm like what sort of thing so um excuse me messy cool Ooh. so yeah um she's doing really well um been to the doctor a few times just to check her over because obviously um, I got new parent anxiety all the time. Oh my god! Oh no! She's got baby spots, um, mainly because she pukes up and then it kind of dribbles down her face and onto her head, um, like in the night when she's asleep. Um, and um, well, you get like milk spots anyway when the baby drinks milk and dribbles and stuff. So um, yeah, milk spots all over the all over her head. I was like, oh dear, Esme, what have you been doing? But um, yeah, she's not sleeping through the night though, obviously, because she's a baby. Um, at the moment, my partner's on tw um, shifts till about half twelve, so he gets home about half twelve and um, takes over from me. And um. No, 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 no. Um, yeah, he takes over for me, and then he stays up t to about um, four o'clock, half three, and then she goes to sleep about then, and then she wakes up about six, and then I take over at six in the morning for, and I give her a feed. Um, but at night we're giving her uh, like a couple of bottles of formula because um because I'm not making a whole lot of milk, I have to say. I'm making like a fair amount, but when I start to get tired it starts dwindling and um, I don't have enough money for an electric pump to pump at the same time as I'm feeding her sort of thing, so um, we just have to make do at the moment. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool. And uh, although he's, he's doing seven o'clock shift soon, so it'll be like the opposite way around, I think. I'm going to have to go to sleep as soon as he gets back from work, which will be about four o'clock. Ah! And then um, I'm going to have to be up like half the night with her, I think. Poor little sausage has to be up with mummy. Oh no! <laughs> um, so yeah, that's been really good. She's, um, well, she, obviously she was seven pounds two when she was born, and now she's about eight two. Um, last time we had a weighed, but we need to have a weighed again. Um, we've been to baby group twice, um, but they're in. It's in the morning, so it's a bit difficult because she obviously sleeps in the morning at the moment, and so we haven't been that much. Um, next week, I've got a family worker coming over to take me to a different baby group, which is a bit further away. Which because um, Alex has been coming with me the last couple of times to baby group. Um, Obviously, I have still have anxiety, but it's it's not. I can. Oh, my hair looks mental. Excuse my hair. I just shouldn't have shoved it up. Cause it was frizzy and meh. Um. So yeah, Alex has been coming with me to baby group twice. But next week I've got a family worker coming, and um, she's she's gonna pick me up in her car. We're in, it's about fifteen minutes up the road, I think, which is um. A little bit far at the moment, but we're managing to make it round the block a few times. Like, try and go out at least every other day, if not every day, at the moment. Um, yay! So, yeah, my anxiety is like halved at the moment. Although, some days I wake up and I feel really low, I'm like, ugh, because I'm tired and lethargic. Um, but I have to remember to take my iron every day because it really doesn't help when I forget my iron sort of thing. It's not, not, not good. Not good is it? She agrees even though she's asleep. <laughs> um, 
So yeah, I, I don't like getting anemic or anything. It sucks. It sucks. But yeah, um, I, I still eat fish, I started eating fish, I started eating fish a few weeks before the end of my pregnancy because I started craving it. And then um, now I'm eating at least two or three times a week um, some like salmon or tuna or something like that. I don't I don't eat tuna three times a week though obviously because it's not not good for you or the baby for the mercury and rubbish and poo that kind of stuff full of poo full of poo so yeah uh, yay it's me um I'm about I still about God, my head is not mental I'm still about as, um about a stone heavier than I was. Um, so I need to do some weight really but um, I got a doctor check up soon about uh, next week I think um, so well it's I know some people go for six weeks but I'm going for an eight week for some reason I'm not sure why but never mind um, her NHS card has come and so she's official NHS patient Woo! Um, not that the NHS will be around for very long at this rate. God damn you. Um, um, yay. We got a birth certificate. I don't know whether I said that already. But um, yeah, she's officially Esme Holly Luna Burnt. But now I'm not sure whether I should have called her Esme Luna Holly Burnt. It kind of sounds better, but never mind. I'm sure if she can change it when she's older, she's that bothered. Because we just call her Ez anyway, so meh. Oh well. Yay! She's grown out of all her size one newborn clothes. And um, well she's still in size one newborn nappies though. Um, although she's starting to fit the size two newborn ones a little bit, not not a lot, but um nappy wise. Um well, she is wearing huggies at the moment, but the huggies ones that they're, they're really loose, and not not because she's too big or small or whatever. Um, it's because I don't know. A lot of people say they're loose, so um, because the the Pampers ones fit her like quite well, but uh, they actually smell really bad of chemicals, so they're horrible. Um, we tried. What else have we tried? Are we going to try the Sainsbury Eco ones? Um, that be nice? Yeah. Oh, we, we've got some in the cupboard to try. And we've tried the Aldi ones, which are too thin. But um, generally they fit, but they're just too thin. They don't absorb very well. Um, too thin. Oh no. So um, the best ones so far are the Tesco's ones, actually. They're actually really, really good. Um, so just like new, newborn yellow packets sort of thing, and um, they're a little bit cheaper than Pampers, which is good. Very, very really good. So we need to stock up on them really. Although I heard um, the Asda ones are very good as well, but I haven't tried them yet. Just tried the Tesco ones. So far, Whee, hello, my name is Asda. Blah 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 blah. Wee! So yeah. Um, so yeah, I think we're going around, well, aren't they? Wee! So, um, yeah, we're moving house in about two or three weeks. So I'm trying to pack up everything and look up the baby, which is a bit mental. Um, which is not nice, is it? So it's not nice. Very tiring. Um, but we're just moving around the corner, which is pretty good. Uh, we've got a two bedroom place in a kind of councilly. It's it's like a councilly block of flats, but we we're not renting it from the council. We're renting it from private landlady, um, which is more expensive. But um, we just couldn't really wait for the council. Really, um, our place is filling up pretty fast with baby stuff, and although we're like getting rid of stuff as fast as we're getting stuff, it's just like madness. Mad this sort of thing. So that's not good. Um, what else? What else, sausage? 
Hi, my baby. What up, man? What you talking about? No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, she likes pretending to talk. Um, she's really strong, actually. Um, she pushes out her legs and tries to pogo off me quite a lot. Um, she's pretty good at lifting her head now. I'm looking around quite a lot. Very strong. Yes. Can you see her? Hmm. So yes, yeah, she's asleep. Um, she loves listening to music. When I put music on, usually she calms down. Not all the time, but quite a lot. Um, she likes uh, things like Baby Got Colic, which is um, if you type it into YouTube, it's a white noise sort of thing, and um, that's really good. Actually, um, um. Um, if you add me to Spotify, you'll be able to see her playlist. Uh, I think I'm Jelly Dashes on Spotify, sort of the same as my Facebook sort of thing. She's got her own Twitter as well. Um, you can add her at Baby S B, B A B Y E S B. Um, she tweets all the time. Very advanced baby. Of course. Um, so yeah, you can see what she's up to, sort of thing. I just pooped my nappy. No, she doesn't say that all the time. Well, she'd be saying it several times a day. Um, yeah, she likes a chair as well, which is nice. I could take her downstairs with my chair, although I don't like taking her downstairs because I keep slipping on the stairs, like, and I'm worried that I'm going to drop her one day. So, um, if I can, I'll leave her for a few minutes in a Moses basket. She is rapidly growing out of because she's so tall. Like she's not very wide, but she's just very tall. Takes after like my brother and that side of the family sort of thing. Huge, huge. Not not small like mum. Hey. Um. So yeah, well, we've been able to get out and about, which is pretty good. Um. Although I'm a bit anxious at the moment. I don't know why. I think it's because of the stress of moving and stuff. So that's not really surprising. Um, we got a cot today, which is great. We bought it off a colleague's daughter. Um, and it's very nice. Um, it was about 60, 65 pounds, I think. And then we bought all the bedding as well. And it was really good, actually. It's really well looked after. And we're so impressed. Yay! So she's going to get her own little nursery and her own little room in our new place but it'll probably be shared with some other junk for now but um, obviously she's going to stay in our room for a while <laughs> So the other music that she's been listening to and she seems to like is um, Grooving and Green She likes that room um, she likes some Faith in the Muse. Unfortunately, she doesn't like Fear of the Nephilim, but maybe one day she will. <laughs> if I play it nothing. Oh, they've obviously sold out. I think they've sold out now. I don't think I can get a ticket. But, um, but I'm, I'm a bit worried about like getting to gigs and stuff, because I don't know whether I'll be able to leave her and be like, No, not my baby. No. Um, I really would like to go to a festival in June. It was about an hour away, but um, again, I don't know whether I'll be able to leave her yet. Well, obviously, I'm not going to leave her on her own, but I mean, like, leave her with my parents or whatever. I'd quite like to go, but I don't know. I don't know. Um, so, yeah, obviously, that's a big life changing sort of thing. Um, but yeah, it's amazing how much how much attention you get when you have a baby it's like obviously we've had like loads and loads of family over but like people like random people will talk to you in the street and go oh what a cute baby which is funny and also um yeah just people want to come round and like see the baby and or go out for walks with the baby and it's just like it's really strange <laughs> very strange I don't know why. Well, I do actually. She's so cute, that's why. <laughs> oh, jumping. There's lots of moths around here. We'll be glad to go with us. We actually live um, 
down in um, at the back of an alleyway with bins so it's very like well I've, I've probably told you this in, in half my blog vlogs blog box but uh, yeah it's disgusting so we'll be glad to go but this this plot we're moving to has loads of um, families and stuff so that will be really good <laughs> Yeah, I'll show you how big she's gotten. Oh dear! Oh, she started like cooing and stuff. She's cute. There you go. Not not showing everyone her legs. Oh, oh dear! Working her out. I'm not impressed. Not impressed, are you? Hmm. Hmm. Show you from behind. Hold on. I put you on my shoulder. Oh, oh dear. I oh, can't see that way. See that way. No. Oh. Okay, I'm just knocking everything over now. But yeah, you get the general idea. She's got really big feet as well. Congratulations! Mm. Mm. Oh, she's so cute. <coughs> but yeah, I always post up like little videos of her that I've taken. So yeah, feel free to subscribe or just send me ten million pounds. That'd be nice. Thanks very much. Thanks very much, sausage. <laughs> so yeah. That's um, probably about it. All I've got to report from it's been very rainy, and I talk to the baby all the time like this because I'm mad, mad. Yes, I am. Okay, well, thanks for watching. Bye. -bye.